Hello, and happy Older Adults Month, which really is every month. Hi, I'm Zoe Bird, and I'm a poet, editor, and teaching artist with Prime Life Arts Learning, here with a simple poetry prompt anyone can use to jumpstart their writing. The subject is litanies. These days, litany most often has a negative connotation, like a litany of complaints, but really, Litany originally meant, and can certainly still mean, a prayer or a petition consisting of a series of invocations or a resonant chant. I was inspired to write a litany a couple of years ago in April of 2020, um, not long after the pandemic shut down, when I was taking another look at this fabulous little book by Deborah Keenan, a St. Paul poet who collected a group of wonderful writing prompts that she had offered her students over the years and put them into this book called From Tiger to Prayer. Deborah Keenan's prompt is, ask yourself, what matters enough to me to write a litany? And when I thought about that, I thought about how one of the few things that felt like it was keeping me going was going outside every day and looking for the new leaves of the plants coming up in the yard, in the neighborhood. They gave me so much hope. So I wrote a litany called Leaf Litany. Here it is. Leaf Litany. Boneset, burdock, barrenwort, lungwort, wormwood, cat's ear, hawkbit, hawksbeard, dandelion, hollyhock, columbine, clover, creeping jenny, Rhubarb, iris, chive, tiger lily, allium, lupin, fern, garlic, tarragon, angelica, oregano, violet, strawberry, yarrow, elder, and countless maple sprouts clasped like hands. Thank you for listening, and may you enjoy creating your own litany.